Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope you are having a creative day. In this video, I'm going to teach you how you can use different layout in Slideshow in Mixer Studio. So one of the questions I got on my uh, video about Slideshows is that um, how can we use different layout in different slides in the Mixer Studio? So um, the short answer is that there is no way to uh, do that. Okay, so for example, if I use um, this uh, Slideshow repeater, and I go to different slides, they will have the similar layout. And that's because this is a repeater. And in repeater, we use the same layout, just different items. So you will have different headings, different um, images, but the basic layout will be the same, okay? So if I go to the preview of this website, and um, if you look at different uh, slides in it, you will see that all of those uh, slides have same layout right here okay so yeah you cannot do that but there is a workaround um, by which you can use different elements in the slideshow so let me show you how to do that it's really easy uh, before we talk about that um, now my freelancer services are online so you can um, i will drop the link in the description you can go there and if you want to um, hire me as a freelancer for SEO or website design. You can uh, go to the link um, and get the code right here. So what we're gonna do to uh, use different layout for the slideshow is uh, we're gonna use the flex box instead of the slideshow repeaters. So go to the flex box and add a flex box right here. Okay, now reset the size like this and set the item width to 100% or uh, 90 whatever you want you can uh, set the width as well now what you can do is go to the layers select the flex box here and in the settings select slides okay now you have uh, created a custom slideshow using the flex box and these are your slides these items okay now what you can do here is select this item and add any layout any custom element you want so i'm going to add a title here like this and i'm going to add an image right here Okay, now go back to the layers and pick this item on top because these items are hidden on the left side. Okay, so in order to uh, make them visible, we can simply take them on the top right here so that you can work on it. Okay, so this item right here is um, on the right side. All right, so in this item, we're gonna add some other element. Let's add a video, simple video. Okay, um, let's go to another item, this one. Take it on top and add your own layout. Whatever you want, you can do this um, on this slide. You can add whatever you want. It won't affect other, uh, items other slides let's uh, do this for this item as well let's add something else let's add a social bar and let's add a paragraph okay this is just to show you that you can add different elements um, let's add one more element so select the flex box and you can add more item, okay? And work on it as well. So you can add as many slides, as many items as you want. Right, now we have to add a button as well. So what I'm gonna do is go to the flex box and go to the settings. Um, you can hide the scroll bar uh, in the bottom. So simply 
uh, turn it off and it will remove the uh, scroll bar and add the navigation so i'm going to add the navigation button you can also add text and arrows so i'm going to go with the button for this one and it will add the previous and the next button and now you have your slideshow so let's add one more here okay now let's look at the preview all right so as you can see now we have different layout for each slide okay you can add different elements without affecting other um, slideshows other elements now you can go back and if you want you can uh, change the navigation so we go to the flex box and in the navigation you can add arrows for example and remove these ones okay now you have the arrows here you can also add the text you can um, add the items as well just uh, click on add items um, you can also add the um, scroll bar so you can uh, for example on mobile uh, people can simply uh, you know swipe their fingers and uh, you know change the slides so there are different options here as well so you can work on each individual item each individual slide one by one without affecting the uh, other slides so that's how you uh, can change the layout of each slide this is not possible uh, with the slideshow repeater so if I uh, for example add the slideshow repeater here and if I um, remove this image for example this will remove the image from all the slideshow so if I look at the preview it will remove the images from everything all slides but the same uh, does not happen for the flexbox. You can add different elements and not worry about what happens um, in other slides. So yeah, that's how you um, add different layout in different slides. Um, simply add the flexbox, select the slides and work on each slide one by one. The important thing is you have to go to the layers and um, Put the item that you want to work on on the top like this so that it is visible on your um, editor so yeah that's how you do it um, i hope you learned something thanks for watching